Hi, Cornea Solutions here, again with a tutorial on Excel lists through data validation. Today we will learn the following topics. How to make a list, how to give instructions on the list, and what error message you can fill in for the user. Right now I will show you an example for the data validation list. I've made a color field and a list of selection of colors. We will be making this today together. Start out with a blank worksheet and fill some cells in in the same column. In another worksheet, select the cell in which you want to have the list. Click on data and on data validation. You will see a pop-up. On the pop-up we click on allow field, we select list and then we click on the source field, we navigate to the worksheet in which we have put all the colors in and we select all the cells containing our colors. Next we click on input message tab and we select the title for our message. In this case, I've chosen the title, choose your favorite color. Then you can add even more description in the message box. Now we can click finally on the error alert tab and we can choose here a message, a title for our error message and also a complete message, more descriptive message for our error. We finish by clicking OK. Now you see that there is an arrow down button in this field. And you see the message, choose your favorite color, whatever you need, what we filled in in the message box. If you click the arrow down, you can see all the possibilities that we've set in our selection. You can choose whatever color you want and you can delete the inputted color with the backspace button or the delete button. The nice thing is, if you want to fill in a field that does not exist in your list, the user will get an error message. So here you see the error message and the title that we've chosen before. If you type down first letters of an existing option in the list, you will see that it will pop up. For instance, for black it popped up. Just to do another test, I tap the G and you see the green is popping up because it's in my list. Thank you very much for watching everyone. This was my video on Excel list data validation. I will be posting more Excel tutorials but also other software tutorials. Please subscribe and like to stay updated and share to support the channel. Thank you very much. See you soon.